Hello everyone, it's Jade and welcome back to the Sims 4 Lovestruck LP. I don't know why I said it like that. It feels bad. Um, <laughs> it's been a little while since I played. I kind of played like four parts in a row, but now we are back. Um, and I just want to keep the love going. Oh, I forgot to literally me. Oh my God, don't worry about me guys. <laughs> Um, it is a gloomy day. We have a few things set up, but uh, it's Saturday morning. Sorry, after, oh my, mm. afternoon. I'm gonna get uh, Dustin to come down here and uh, take care of that for me. And also what I'm just gonna immediately do is I'm gonna buy us that bin that we can get. That's like, <gasps> wait, that was 300 for a bit. Am I, that was 300 bucks for a bit. They've moved that to 1200 instead of cheeky little buggers. <gasps> wow, never mind. We're too poor for that right now. But anyway, so they've all kind of slept in quite late. It's like 2 p.m. But hopefully we're gonna probably have another big night tonight. Um, Dustin did get some and we're still a little, uh, I guess, completely unsure, but still kind of maybe working on who we're additional partner is going to be with um becca i also did go through and give a few sims makeovers i don't i did really didn't do any but like i gave penny a makeover penny looks like a snack i gave claire a makeover she's my little hip-hop queen i gave eva a makeover um i did think i placed two other guys into the world um potentially for katie to meet but i probably will do a few more makeovers i don't think i did anybody from delilah's panel it was pretty much all just from dustin's panel but yeah i'll kind of keep trying to do that as i keep going of course um i'm gonna wake katie up so she doesn't sleep in all day as well dustin was gonna be our little cook of the house right oh well let's get delilah to cook some food <gasps> they're gonna have a little chat this is like taking forever to do this. Let's serve some lunch, some fried chicken sliders while you're a big smelly butt. Cool. Wow. Damn, I forgot Katie looks like a snack in her jammies. All right, well, that's happening. Um, you're perfect for your career as well. You just need to do a bit of cooking and you need to go to work now. Wow, feels bad. He's so smelly too. Ooh. Look, have a really quick like, yeah, go now. One bite and you're off. Um, let's put that in the sink. Oh, thanks, Delilah. Katie, can you put away the food? Yeah, let's see if anything's happening on the app. Cupid's Corner, let's open her up. She is so cute. Wait, can we do like... Oh, I feel like Katie is very innocent and she wouldn't take a picture in her. She's like innocent, but like, you know. I feel like she wouldn't post anything that has like her undergarments in it but it's like already there so live your best life katie maybe she is not interested in adults uh jayla christy taylor han irene mainly females but it's just because i think it's a default setting that i need to update titus hates children no outgoing materialistic quinton unfloaty in a rancho Stacy looks cute, but we're after a gentleman. Rat, ra rancher and jealous. Outgoing and bro. Mitchell. I don't think I've ever um, done anything with him in any world. Like any save ever. We're just gonna be open to it though. Of course, of course. We're gonna leave that. But perhaps that's, a, that's an option there. They get along. They, they click. All right um yeah she just wants to have a romantic partner find her soulmate um reveal a deep secret i like basketball <laughs> imagine have two or more partners <gasps> have two or more very satisfied relationships go on three dates with the partner sim i'm so stressed perhaps i've been kind of doing like both uh female and female kind of looking at for her relationships but maybe what we should also be open to is having one of each. That could be quite interesting. Um, but I don't think anybody in here is kind of really screaming. Oh, and I gave Ty a makeover, that's right. And I was kind of very interested in maybe like chucking Ty in somewhere, but I'm holding back on it. Um, perhaps 
do you have much of Cupid's Corner open? You've been lucky enough to meet a lot of um, your relationships in person. You're so cute. Oh my God, <laughs> me. Um, we've got Cole, Panya, Monica, Pheasant, Camila. Jayla is in here. She just, uh, she really wants to get amongst it. Claire, how good did I do that makeover though? Claire looks good. She's just love and romantic. Look, she looks like a snack. We'll keep her there. Amaya, Amaya looks cute too. Right. Report Sam. So these are ones that are actually downloaded from the gallery. That is so cute. I'd be so happy if any of my sims came up in somebody else's. Edward, an adult high maintenance and a klepto. Probs not. Cringe and loves the outdoors. Trenton. I don't like his receding balding hair, but <laughs> could be cute just because I feel like she'd love a cringe sim. Jacqueline. This is a turn on for Delilah Octavio. Mmm. Perhaps. Gavin? What, which pack is he from? I forget. Is he a base game sim too? I'm such a bad person. Becky, I love like seeing them with their makeovers. It looks so good. We're gonna, pal, we're just gonna throw them out. Um, not, maybe Octavio? Jayla. <laughs> I can give Jayla a makeover just because uh, they pop up all the time. But yeah, so we've got kind of some partying to do this afternoon. I should probably give them like a few party outfits. Actually, let me do that now. More that I want them to have a few different kind of outfits to play with if we're going out quite often. I'm back. Uh, I don't know why, but I was just having such a barrier block to making their outfits. I've got two additional party outfits each, except for Dustin. Feels bad I left him out just then. My hope is, uh, yeah. I just kind of made the outfits. I kind of don't love them, don't hate them, but um, we'll keep going through. I just said, but um, and it reminds me of how I met your mother. Are you stuck, Missy? Let's reset you. Maybe we can teleport you. No, that's not the button. Create an animal. Hold on, I'm working. I'm working with you here. Can we just, how do I tell, there you go. Okay, fabulous. Hopefully that fixes that problem. <laughs> oh, research and debate skill. The skill that I hate the most. What are you two going on about? Oh my goodness. I am just doing terrible right now. <laughs> okay, let's take the rubbish out. But I'm thinking let's uh, let's head out. Let's travel. I feel like I should put like another nightclub out somewhere. I should probably should take him back. Um, You've got like a lounge here. Ah, you've got the gym, you've got Nadia. I feel like I need to add in like some more fun places. Like we don't need to rent a lot here. That's crazy. Cool, well maybe we'll just try the lounge like across the road to here. Oh, this place, right. I remember this place. Hold on, give me two seconds. I'm gonna see if there's a renovated version of this. Okay. Okay, I'll take it. This is the uh, a renovated version. Um, we'll just go with this. Okay, well, um, everyone's apparently here. Oh, I've, oh my beautiful. I would like to, wait, you can interact with these, can't you? Why are the lights on the door? <laughs> they were just like, mm, I do love these lights, rose petals everywhere. We've got our pianist, we've got like our love seats. Ooh, ee. And if you want to get married, there's also that option. Or if you want to sell some stuff. Are they both going for a drink? Order a drink. Order a drink. Perfect, my ladies. What's this? Is that a dance floor there? Oh, guys, stop. There's karaoke. We'll get into that too. Sounds superb. Okay, well, I'm thinking maybe we could invite... We're gonna invite Beck out because Beck is our one and all. Invite over. If she's busy, she's busy. We can invite out Ty. I'm thinking. Wait, we invite. Wait. Octavio. We're gonna invite Octavio out. What's your favorite? Do they order their favorite drinks? No, they've just ordered drinks. Okay, and then you don't really have like a favorite person, do you? No. Not so lucky, my love. Bex here, my love. <gasps> We're not cheating. 
<laughs> that sounded so aggressive. <laughs> but we're not. We've asked if we go in a motel. Dive with the reals? Is there a... Oh, they could do that there is... Oh, my honey. Hey, Ty. Bestow our empathy. Best you. Oh, I went to go flirt with you. I didn't mean to. Interests. Okay. Uh, great reputation. Good friends. Well, I'm really hoping so. Oh, Octavia is here. Friendly. Deep thoughts. <gasps> the number six will be... Stop. <laughs> hey, wait. Stop. Funny. Tell a dirty joke. Let's see how that flies. Octavio could be cute. <gasps> Delilah has felt a spark of reform. Should she change... Wait, should she change her love bug ways and live a more romantically reserved? How interesting. If that's what she feels, we will support her. But romantically reserved, the only thing is that that means she doesn't really want to be romantic unless she's built a good relationship with people, which is also okay. But that just takes a, who else? She's romantically reserved, right? Yeah. Well, they're developing as they develop. Ooh, Katie is now very attractive. Wait. S <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Sorry, I got up. I have to change positions because my toes are cold. But <laughs> stop. I did have like when I originally started this, like uh, Katie would either be interested in like Dustin or whatnot, but they have this attraction to each other. But Katie's technically not to meant to be interested in the ladies. I'm not interested in joining Powerhouse. Thanks though. Um, I'm really scared about this, but let's confess to cheat. No, I'm too scared. Tenderly embrace. Funny. Friendly. Let's build up our friendship. I don't know, make it toast. Welcome to the group. <laughs> Sorry, going through all these menus just really gives me anxiety sometimes, especially when I'm trying to do stuff. Why are you guys not like able to have like a decent combination uh, conversation? She's only got like silly behavior, very like minimum interactions. Maybe they're intending to leave. He is an adult, so he's a bit older. Oh, you and Ty are getting along? I was going to say, I'm not even sure if they're friends. Funny. Why are, like, the interactions so low? Friendly? No. Okay, they're all back. We're going to romantic, uh... Ask a seductive dance? Oh, what's this? Please tell me you're not crushing on somebody else. I'm just very confused as to why, like, half the interactions aren't loading up. Let's enthuse about vampires. Discuss puzzles? Compliments, heartfelt compliment, deep thoughts. Whoa, my girl is huge. Wow, they have a good relationship already. And this is about video games again. Sorry, I keep going back to the same things. You're so fun to be around. I really enjoy spending time with you and I hope you feel that way too. Her and Ty are good. This is good. They're a couple. They're a couple, right? Just became good friends with Delilah. I'm not used to their friendships going up so fast. Deep conversation, romantic, discuss dating standards, reveal desire, praise beauty. Wow, these are really cool. Ask indecent question. Oh my. Where's like the ask if single? I'm so stressed. He's waving, right? Romantically reserved. Delilah is a romantically reserved sim, so these sims navigate the path of love with thoughtful consideration, cherishing the depth of emotional bonds rather than rushing of rather than the rush of fleeting attractions. Um, for them, a romantic journey is painted with heartfelt conversations and significant actions that strengthen their bonds. However, taking such a cautious approach to love may occasionally result in mischance at romance. Octavia is pleased to gain deeper insight into Vi in Delilah's love perspective. Both Sims are now feeling more confident about how they sh about their shared romantic future. Oh my, stress levels. Well, maybe you and Ty can go do some. Please, can you do it with Ty? Heck yes. Wow. 
Waba Shiba Bazaar Grubau. Oh my god. Oh my. I don't think you were single from my memory. Wait, I can quickly go in here. Spouse none. Stoilus Teardresser. I'm trying to see if I can express fresh devotion. <gasps> Did she just say it was too much? We we went through our boundaries. We're open. What? This is gonna start stressing me out. Is she like hurt? She did the little bye thingy, right? Does not trigger jealousy, does not trigger jealousy, triggers jealousy. <laughs> Guilty, feels bad about something that happened with Becca but doesn't know how to make it right? Oh my god, this is stressing me out. Yeah, Becky, where are you going? Back? Back? <sighs> Back! Bring dust. Oh my, wrong clicking the button. I'm stressed because I'm trying to do this, uh, this open relationship to three people <laughs> and it's just not going well. Look, I'm very much a, a partner for life kind of girl. Oh, everyone's going home. Oh no, they're at the front. But is Octavio here? Oh, I'm scared. Well, I guess I just don't think anything's really out and about oh well oh because it's down the road so technically you're still here oh my gosh <laughs> um anyway what do you reckon maybe we'll just head home maybe we should have a house party that would oh i see let's just can we just travel to this lot go home it's just really not where you are right now <laughs> i just feel like it's so failed all right Let's go just go take a shower. Oh no, he needs to eat too. Go take a shower here, get leftovers. You are perfectly fine. I'd like you to invite Beck over for the night maybe. Oh, it's gonna be like, I'm sleeping right now. Okay, whatever. All right, she's gonna hit the hay. You're already in bed, you love to see it. Okay, there's a couple of things I have to work on, but perhaps we can get that done. It's just kind of, I don't know, developing relationships and it will all take time. Oh my god. Um, perhaps before you go to bed, can we just like jump on Cupid's Corner? I feel like I'm probably gonna have to do a makeover for a bunch of people. My only worry is that if I give all these people makeovers and then they don't actually become a part of his life. You know what I'm saying? Oh stop it, you. Araline hates children. Loyal and a foodie, Nina. Doesn't she look gorgeous? I did good. I did good. And he's he's uh he's attracted to that. Ooh, e. Okay, we shouldn't fight over Eva. But he's good with Penny and Claire. I was gonna say Clary. <laughs> Why are all my Sims attracted to this chick? <laughs> You know what? Because it's Jayla, let's just add Jayla in. I'm giving Jayla a makeover. They are literally just out and about. She's literally out and about. We've got Haley. We've got Josephine. Everybody loves that hair. Maritza. Ooh. Kind of like the name. Lactose intolerance a bit rough, but... Oh, Vasco. Oh, it's very much like a yes, but I want to dodge it. <laughs> And then Megan. Okay. So this is what Claire used to look like, right? And that's Claire now. I'm surprised I didn't refresh the pictures here. Let's add Jayla to contacts. Penny's in there. Doesn't Penny look like an absolute snack in here? Eva and Constance. Okay, we'll give Constance a makeover. And... Okay. The reason I'm wanting to do this is because I'm wanting to put some more effort into their relationships, right? And I'm going to start like hiding people from the panel. But if we just do, let's open your Cupid's corner. She's yelling at herself in the mirror. Please don't. She can't me try to calm down. Is this because of, <sighs> she's so cute. I need to get her a picture though. Almost like this is Katie in her own essence. Stop. Where's like the light one? I feel like none of these are you. <laughs> oh my god, don't do that with your apples, please. I just want the first one back now. 
This one? Oh, that's such a good picture, Katie. Haha. -ha. Dislikes photography? Why? You can't just dislike photography because you suck at it. Look, I'll do a better one in future. We're just going to go with this for now. Oh, we can't refresh her matches just yet. Did she end up matching with anyone? That's right, she matched with Mitchell. We can do Mitchell. Bit of a makeover. Okay, everybody's in bed. Sunday morning. Oh no. I can't wait to start getting money. Literally, my other two LPs are so rich, but uh, here we are. <laughs> um, and that's totally okay. All right, we're getting some brekkie. You're almost awake. You need a bit more sleep. You've got a crappy bed, that's why. Um, Get leftovers. And come have a bit of a chat with Katie. Funny? Tell her a funny story. They're both romantically reserved now. How about that? Interest? Discuss fitness techniques? So how does this work? This sim wants to have da -da -da, affection. Sims have slow romantic satisfaction loss. Yeah, okay. Well, shall we invite Octavia over and Beck over? And we'll see if we can have the grown-up discussion? What are you doing? You're going to have bubble bath? I'll just take a bath. Okay. He doesn't have a partner, does he? We'll find out. Hey, Octavio. Because I can definitely just do a freshie. He's a bit older than us. Which means he's going to be like an elder when we're too young. So maybe we should... You keep him as a friend. I do like the idea of him, but maybe he's a bit too old. No. Variety. Variety in the relationship. It just means that he'll die first. He'll get old first. <laughs> Wait, how far is he in? Okay. He's an adult day one. So he was literally. Okay. Let's, uh, can we invite you in? <gasps> oh, stop. Can we, before Octavio comes in? I'm scared. How do I relationship? Propose? Swap? Oh, it's such a joint household. I wouldn't even be mad about it. It's also raining in the background. Sorry if you do hear it. Ask to reconsider romantic boundaries. To accept. Ask to not accept. Ask to accept woohoo. And then let's, uh. I'm so scared. She's like, yeah, okay. Will not feel jealous. Okay. <laughs> I am stressed. Deep conversation. So I'm really exper experimenting here. Oh, she's doing her homework at university. I love Beck so much. <laughs> she's playing this game by herself. Stop. Um, can I, what can Katie do to stay away from all of this right now? We really don't have, we do have money, but I don't think she has any research to Skill. Um, she can literally practice that in the mirror upstairs. Practice debate. Yes. Okay. Katie, out of here. We're having a an open rel we can always kick one person out of the relationship, right? <laughs> um, hold on, let me get to know their other traits. They're a dog lover, perfectionist, and cheerful. We are very attracted to and we're also very attracted to Katie. <laughs> <laughs> I could always technically maybe age Octavia down and we can start a bit fresh. Um, oh my god, I'm so stressed. Okay, so let's do a romantic interaction with Beck. Charm. Okay, bear with me. Beck's like, excuse me? <laughs> oh, I'm so nervous for all of this. Okay, Beck didn't react. Is she jumping in on this? Is she feeling romantic? She's both playful. Clam. Okay, let's try another romantic uh, interaction. R discuss dating standards. And then maybe we can reveal desire, the flea markets in town. I'm actually like just so stressed right now. <laughs> what does she want to do with Beck? Express devotion. Mm, get it out of here. She's so chill. She's good. She's good. Okay. She got up and I was like, oh no, she's she's feeling um <sighs> This is so stressing me out. Okay, hold on. So if we do like a romantic physical intimacy, like a a, a tenderly embrace. <laughs> this is making me so anxious. 
Oh, no, they're going to do some physical intimacy in front of you. Okay, Bex, chill with it. Bex, chill with it. Did she just do, like, her little finger thingy? Like, the will kind of vibes? Okay, okay, okay. Was he a dog lover or a cat lover? Because that's a defining factor also. <laughs> Perfect! <laughs> um, right, okay. So much stress right now. Okay, can they kiss? It'd be really nice if he then also has a romantic relationship with Beck. And maybe I can work on that. Wait. Yeah, she doesn't get jealous of those interactions. Might go off screen and make them a romantic relationship as well. Um, so then they're like a, a, a trifecta. You know the words that I don't know, you know? <laughs> Ask to seductive dance. Oh, I'm feeling a lot of emotions right now. <laughs> Called stress. Romantic. Civilized remark. She can't do any physical. They haven't even got a romantic relationship yet. Ask a decent question. Why is this not giving a romantic relationship? Um, whoa. Regional manager? No, I have to be a love consultant. Hmm. If we go into a relationship, can we ask about romantic interests? And then maybe... Because why is it not jumping in? We did like three romantic interactions. I'm exploring, trying to figure stuff out. Is single. Physical intimacy is back. Hold hands. I love how she was like looking to back. She's like, back? <laughs> God, I hate this. It makes me anxious. Okay, we now have a romantic bar. Okay. I was also nervous about how her romantically reserved side would go with this. A tender neck kiss. This is making me so anxious. I don't know why. So it's just like, oh yes, my girlfriend's kissing his neck. I love it. Is that cheating? Didn't I get rid of your loyal trait? No, you still have it. Okay, I'm gonna have to get rid of the loyal trait because I think the loyal trait still classifies it as cheating. Because we're not cheating. Um, proclaim eternal love. Okay. Okay. Can we uh, relationship change relationship? Um, ask about romance style. Ask about physical attraction. Turn off gift giving. I won't give you any gifts. Not a problem. Uh, looks on everything, but truthfully, I do look out for some physical aspects. Black hair, dark blue hair, green hair, white hair brown clothes well that looks to be moderately us and then if we ask personality attraction i'm trying to how do i find out how attracted they are to us hold on well there are a few things i care about when it comes to a partner personality turn on to taken sims Academic sims, drink making sims, so <laughs> uh, cerebral sims, pet enthusiasts, culinary skills. How they grew together. How interesting. I don't think we're any of those. All right. Well, anyway, guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this here. I'm going to give a few more people makeovers and then hopefully we can jump a bit more into Katie and uh, Dustin's life. But I want to figure out the relationship complex here first. I'll be leaving you here for today, guys. I hope you guys are having an amazing day and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.